In this video, I'm going to show you how this new model speaker diarization rotation work and how you can locally install it. Not only that, but also this model is able to differentiate and annotate speakers in audio recordings, which is huge. It automatically adjusts audio inputs, processes an hour long conversation in only 1.5 minutes and offers features like speaker count control. So what happens is that we can install this speaker diarization rotation locally on your Linux or Windows machine or even in the notebook. And then we give it an audio file, which should be in WAV format, WAV format. And then it transcribes that audio file and then produces an RDTM file. RDTM stands for Rich Transcription Time Marked Files. And they are space delimited text files containing one ton per line per speaker and each line contains various fields like type, file ID, channel ID, and I'll show you shortly. So let's get started. The first thing I'm going to do is show you my notebook. This is a notebook I'm going to use, which is simply an Amazon Linux 2 instance, and I'm using G4DN um, 2XLR instance for this demo. You can even use this on your own laptop on the CPU if you don't have the GPU enabled machine. The first step we need to do is to install this pip install pine uh, node audio. So let's install it. While it's installed, let me show you one quick thing. Once you go to the hugging face repo of this model, scroll down a bit, and then there are these three things you need to do. This is what I just did, prerequisite. Then you need to right click on this, go to its website, which is again on the hugging face, and accept that term and condition because it's a gated model. I already have done it by specifying my information and it has allowed me, it's free. You don't have to do much. So once that's done, you are all good to go. And then you can also, you, you would also need to obtain the token from Hugging Face, which you can do from here. Go to Hugging Face, your profile, and then go to access token and grab this token from here. Don't worry about this. Uh, third item because it is giving me 404 error. So I'm not really worrying about it because it works even without it. So we are all set. Let's go back to our installation. So that is done, which is great. Now in the next step, we are going to import this and set up a token. So in this line, all I'm doing is I'm importing the torch and then I am setting the pipeline for this model from hugging face and I'm specifying my token here. Okay, I already have a sample wave file which is in my own voice and I have already uploaded it as you can see on the right hand side. So in the next step, I'm just um, putting this audio dot wave file which is uh, which I already uploaded to my system in this pipeline. And Let's run it. I'll actually put it in one command so that you could show. So what would happen in this step is that it will process this audio file and then it will produce this uh, rich text transcription file in the same notebook. So let's run it. And as I said, it's very quick. Even for an hour long audio file, it processes it in seconds or minutes. So you can see that this is around two minutes file which ha it has produced and it has produced this RDTM file. Let me quickly show you this RDTM file too, which it has just produced. So this is the RDTM file it has produced. And because it, that audio file is only in my voice, so only there is only one speaker. So you can see that it has only one speaker and it has, um, broken it down into all the tons. So this is it guys. I hope that you enjoyed it. And if you have any questions or if you're struggling to implement it, please feel free to put it in the comments and I'll be happy to help out. And I'll drop the link to this Hugging Face repo too in video's description. And if you want to, uh, if you like the content, please consider subscribing to the channel. Thank you.